The first step in a TCM calibration is pressing the main menu button in the lower right hand corner, pressing the machine receiver tab, which will get you into the settings. From here we can access all of the information dealing specifically with the receiver. For the TCM calibration we want to hit the upper right hand button and then the setup tab. One of the first pieces of the information to check is both the height and the fore and aft position of the receiver. The height is measured from the ground level up to the receiver and right at the break between the yellow and the green on the receiver itself. The fore and aft position is measured from the fixed axle position to the location of the receiver. To enter those values in, simply press on the area with the measurement, which will bring up a keypad, and then we just type those numbers in. Once those values are entered, we can start with the TCM calibration, which can be started by hitting the cal button on the bottom portion of the screen. For step one in the calibration procedure, we want to mark the fixed axle where it is sitting on a flat level surface pressing the enter button and waiting for the step 2 to complete. For step 3 we are going to turn the tractor around and put the wheels in the same position with the tractor facing the opposite way. Once the tractor has been repositioned, we can again hit enter, wait for the calibration to complete, and in step 5 it will show whether the TCM calibration was successful or unsuccessful. The calibration may need to be repeated if it was unsuccessful.